So we are here in the studio. First thing I noticed. <laughs> you love the color purple. Right, so you got your purple door. How much, we'll, we'll take a little look at this. How much time would you say a day that you spend in here? Well, each day is different because of the fact things have to dry. So, I mean, if there's like five landscape styles on the floor that need green, I'll put it all the green on as many of them as I can. And there's Elton John again. And that's the check, huh? That is the check. One thousand dollars. Yep. And that is a very young Jeff, Jeff Hansen. Hansen. To Jeff with thanks and love, oh. Elton John. Is that still cool to you? Yes, extremely. I mean, that should never get old. You know, the couple times that I've visited you, yes. the cool thing is, is this is all different stuff than was oh, here the yes. last time. It, it kind of shows all the progress, but I want to ask you just, you know, so much of your work has incredible texture to it. So like a piece like this, how long will this take to put together to, to uh, complete? Well, the texture has to dry, so maybe a week for that. And then it gets back ground coats, so different greens or one. This one I did multiples, most of them I do multiples. And then it gets the flowers put on it, it gets rolled over by mom and dad in case they think there's any white spots that still show through. It's a family business, we do it together, <laughs> it's not a secret. Or oh, these guys, yeah, what, where, where are we at with this one right now? This is one that mom and I textured last night, or, and this is how far we've gotten. So that would still be really tacky and um, wet, and we you just have to do it in little increments or you lose it. So I'm not going to touch that yeah. one. This one is so classic again with the texture, but the one thing I think you were telling me before is, or maybe your dad was telling me actually, just the little touch-ups mm -hmm. that need oh, to happen the, too. Yeah. Right? The, it's little, the little things details. that I can't see. Like if there'd be gray that, or like gray from the background coat that didn't get hit with the purple or whatever. From your vision standpoint, how much can you see? How much well, is clear? How much isn't? All of it's clear. I mean, it's just little things. That's not supposed to be wrapped over. The tongue goes, but then where that is, it's not supposed to be there. It's supposed to be black. So I mean, little things your like dad'll that. help touch that yes, up then. Yes, exactly. And then I think this is so cool. You were showing me this before because when I look at this, I see the joy that it's going to put on kids' faces. You know, kids that are going through stuff that you went through stuff as a yes. kid. And, and, you know, I think you have this gift of making people feel better. Um, and I'm sure that you can relate to what mm -hmm. some of those young kids are going through. So tell us where all of this is going. Uh, these kid-friendly paintings are going to a Ronald McDonald house in Kentuckiana, Louisville. So it would be, I, I'm guessing with that name, like the Kentucky, Indiana region. Yes. And so this will go in the Ronald McDonald house. You were telling me before that the these aren't one of the more difficult pieces of yes, art that you do. These are one of the very fine, mindless ones. Like if the you, mom said, we need a circle for, or if I saw the job order that says, we need shapes for a kid friendly series. I could do the circle, the triangle, uh, sun, square. But kids Park, look at this, yeah. right? And they see vibrant colors. Exactly. And then they see the little cat, the bunny, the turtle. Yes, the caterpillar. The caterpillar. So that, you know that that's going to yes. bring a lot of kids that are maybe suffering a smile, some joy. Yeah, exactly. How good does that feel? I mean, it, make, it makes me happy to know that it'll make the nurses and the, the, their parents' lives easier and make them happy. Yeah. You know, because most of them are in um, hospitals or schools. The supply area, I guess. Exactly. This is the shooting gallery. This is like that, that game or that contest that they have where they say, guess how many gumballs, oh, yes. right? So what do we think? How many? At, when we counted at our other okay other house a few years ago it was like 3,264 different paints <laughs> that we had at one time. And it feels like every single one of them are here. <laughs> yes. I don't even know how many colors could be in I don't, this. Oh, a lot. Like when you see this, what do you think? I, I, th I think it's really, really busy and it needs work. <laughs> when you finish a project, 
What's uh, that feeling? Painting yeah, painting. You know, just this. you know, anything. Finish this. I mean, anything that you're working on, whether it be something that's going to go to charity or whether it's been something that's commissioned. I'm happy that I'm getting another one done and making, just selling another painting. I mean, it's, it brings me joy. Do any of them bring you more joy than others? Not usually. It's no. just it, it's the next project. Yeah, totally. Yeah. One thing at a time. Right. Well, sometimes it's more than one thing at a well, time, yeah, right? No, totally, but yes. But one moment at a time. Exactly. At least. Okay. What is most difficult? Well, my favorite style, but it's the most time consuming, would either be the cover of the book, which you can get out mm -hmm. there again if you need it, or something like this guy, or these the circles, okay. the polka dots, because they're the most contemporary and they get the most colors. And then I love the I love the paint cans over here. Thank you. All right. And those are just those are just fog, cans that right? are paint, like from cans or um, for when we shoot the lines. This painting right here, what I see along with the texture is just the way those colors are so vibrant, especially the red. I know it's not purple, yes. but it just pops. How many hours would you think it would take to do this, and what, uh, what are the challenges? It's countless because of how many these each layer has to dry and how many times a hand has touched that mm. to get that color on there. The red drugs that are like this of the red paint are $120 mm. of the golden brand. Thick, right? Extremely it's thick. Super extremely thick. high pigment and a high gloss. We've seen some of the finished yes. products, but this is early stages. This is a one that's still in the drying process and it was textured with putty knives. Okay, so textured with? Textured with flexible modeling paste, then um, carved out, if you will, with putty knives. Like drywall putty knives. And your parents were saying before that, that you get to a point where you say, all right, yep, I'm done. Is, is that generally the usual certain amount of time, or is it just a feel? It, ju it just depends on like what else has gone on that what else has gone on that day. Um, what else I have to do? I mean, it's just it's different every day. You gotta be feeling it though. Yes. Right? So if you're not feeling it, you're not gonna be as productive. Correct. Shut us down. So when you get out of here, I saw some video games upstairs. Yes. I saw you on the phone. What yeah. what what is your way either, to unwind? Either just watching TV, iPad, or doing PlayStation Four. And that gets you away yes. from this, right? Exactly. I mean, everybody needs a break yes. from their passions from whatever it is. Exactly. You know, the thing that I love about walking around, not just in the studio, but yes. around the house, is everywhere you look, there's something. There's something amazing art, but also these are fun little gifts here. These are fun little gifts. These are four of my puzzles that are available for purchase at Hallmarks or from the Springbok website. This is our book that Dad wrote. Mm -hmm. Lessons from Claude. Lessons from Claude. And then above you will see different note card sets that are all available on my website. How much, and I'm speaking as someone that enjoyed these, how much do people like these cards? People love these cards. Um, about every day, I'm going back to what we said earlier, mom is having me write a thank you note for an order. Mm -hmm. Almost every day. Six cards. cards and six envelopes. Pretty awesome. They're beautiful. Thank you, thank you. Jeff, thank you so much for having thank us you. out. And yes. any final message here? Well, don't forget about my um, new philanthropic goal, 10 million by 30. I'm 25 and I've done 5 million so far. And to don't forget, every act of kindness helps create kinder communities, more compassionate nations, and a better world for all, even one painting at a time. Thank you. Well said. Thanks, Jeff. Thank you.